Hey everybody, this is Mr. Hanahan and welcome to lesson number four of My Personal Wellness. Let's get started. We're going to scroll down to the lesson four topic. And the first thing we're going to do in this lesson is we're going to show you how to change the layout of your home page to something called one column. And then after that, we're going to type our self-reflection into the home page. If you've got your uh, essay that you did in your first lesson digitally, that's great. We do a copy and paste. Or you can basically just type into the page. And the last part of this video tutorial, we're going to insert a picture of, um, of yourself. Um, you can either grab it off of Facebook, you can take it off a, a digital camera. Um, we just ask that you have a, a picture that um, is going to clearly show your face so we actually know who you are. So it can't be like a thousand feet away and um, it can't have like a helmet or anything like that that we can actually not see what you, what you look like. So let's get started. I'm going to click on my home page. And the first thing that I'm going to do in the edit mode, I'm going to click on where it says layout and I'm going to change it from one column simple which is the default to one column and I'm going to type in self-reflection here and I'm going to basically um, I can type in my self-reflection you can do it that way or you could do a copy and paste uh, whichever works for you I'm going to grab it from my Word document and do control control A and then control C go back to my web page and I'm going to do control V for a paste now what we want to do is we want to put an image in the top right left hand corner of this box and I'm going to put my cursor right there and then I'm going to go to my Facebook account I'm going to download my profile picture I'm going to right click on it and do a save image as I'm going to put it onto my desktop I'm going to call it capture and I'll put it right onto my desktop okay and I've already done this before so it's already there let me close that out and go back to my web page. Okay, so to insert an image, you can click up in the top hand side. I'm still in the edit mode of this page. Insert image, and I'm going to navigate to um, a uploaded image. So I'm going to click on browse. If you get it off of the website address, you can do that as well. But we're going to browse today. I'm going to go to my desktop. I'm going to grab my capture. I'm going to click open. It uploads it. There it is. I'm going to hit OK. And there it is. Now you're going to notice that it inserts in the top. And you may have to change the size to either small, medium, large. I would suggest small is a good place to start. And then you're going to notice we've got this wrap on. And that's going to wrap the text around your picture. And that's it. Okay. So I've got my picture of myself, my profile picture, and I've got my self reflection essay. Just a quick note, you can change the font and you can bold and do a bunch of different things just using the um, text bar up here, size, bold, italics. You can do a bunch of different things to actually make it look consistent with your other pages. If you have any questions with this video, uh, feel free to ask. Thanks for listening.